twerking for peace right now. If they all twerk together, I think that the shark world would be a better place too. Mmm, tasty. John Baystow, Shannon Truax, pop in the culture, new media stew culture pop on the streets of New York. And you can tell by Shannon's prop, we're talking about Sharknado. Watch out! Can't just wait here and wait for Shark to rain down on us. Guys, did you see Sharknado? I saw it. It was it was awesome. Think about it, sharks in a tornado. Come on, what else you gotta say? Hello, Statue of Liberty. Have you seen a Sharknado? Yeah. I've seen pretty silly shark movies, so I'm kind of excited about it. Whole bunch of sharks in the sea, you know, I could blend in with that. Haven't you heard of the atmospherical occurrence where sharks get caught up in a tornado and then rain down upon us? I've never heard that before. That's very interesting. I mean, it doesn't happen that often. This is like the first time in 10 years. Have you ever experienced a Sharknado? No. They whirl around like this, yes. and then they come down and eat you. Here in New York? In New York? It's coming to New York. That's not comforting at all. It's taught in meteorological school. I have no idea. When you're a weatherman, it's the bonus question to get 110. <laughs> weatherman is the one job that you could be wrong 90% of the time and still collect a paycheck. You like Shark Week? Yeah, it's fun. What's your favorite thing about Shark Week? People getting scared about it because they don't want to go swimming. A shark comes, a shark comes. If they're going to attack you in the air, they can certainly attack you in the water. I don't do sharks. I don't like them. What about Sharknado 2? I didn't know they were going to have a Sharknado Believe it or not, there's going to be sharks flying all around the skies of New York. Because that's how they do here. I think that's an amazing idea. They're going to be having sharks flying all around your ass. All around. Does this scare you? You're kind of exposed. They're coming our way. Are you prepared? Yes, I prepare. I have a shelter. I have not heard. You just broke the news to me right now. That's because we are your number one source for all things pop culture. Booyah! Who would you cast in Sharknado 2? You! My new favorite person, Hala, right here. This lovely woman. <laughs> Most definitely Angelina Jolie. Brad Pitt with Angelina Jolie. Brad Pitt, Angelina Jolie. I can't think of a better pair to be in Sharknado 2. I have not even heard of Sharknado 1. <laughs> You haven't heard of Sharknado 1? You've got to be kidding me. What rock have you been living under? Oh, you want to see what they can do, okay? They can fly. Look at that girl. She doesn't even know that that shark's sneaking up behind her. <laughs> oh. She's having a sh oh, 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 oh. Save yourself. <laughs> Ian's ear got swallowed whole by a great white shark, and he sawed his way out of the little mother. Hey, that's retarded, man. That's crazy. How do you think that they're going to top that in Sharknado 2? I have no idea. I'm clueless. They're not. How would Will Smith do it? Oh, Will Smith? Yeah. He'll come out with a chainsaw and tear him apart. <laughs> I'm John Baystow. This is New Media Stew, and your culture has been popped. Your cherry has been popped. Culture. Mmm, tasty. Hi, Hi we're, we're the cast of Vanderpump Rules, and you're watching Media, Media Stew. Stew. Yeah, there you go. They got it. Hey guys, Daily Grace here telling you to subscribe to John Baystow's channel. Did you do it yet? Did you do it?